Vlog number 126, Meriwether Lewis. In today's vlog, I talk about Meriwether Lewis, the American explorer best known for his role as the leader of the Lewis and Clark expedition, also known as the Corpse of Discovery and William Clark. Lewis was born August 18, 1774, and died of a self-inflicted gunshot wound on October 11, 1809. He was only 35 years old at the time. He grew up in the colony that is now known as the state of Virginia. He went to college at Washington and Lee College. He was a soldier, explorer, and politician. He served as the captain in the infantry from 1795 to 1807. In 1803, after President Jefferson made the Louisiana Purchase, he wanted to set an accurate sense of the new land and its resources. He proposed an exploration by Lewis and Clark. The exploration was the first transcontinental expedition to the Pacific coast by a United States citizen. They left in 1805 with Sacagawea and it took two long years to complete. When returning in 1807, President Jefferson appointed Lewis as the governor of the Louisiana Territory. But the part of his life that I'm kind of fascinated with is his death. In 1809, traveling from St. Louis to Washington, he attempted suicide but was restrained. Staying overnight in an inn at Natchez Trace, the innkeeper heard gunshot shots. Lewis was found badly injured from gunshot wounds. He later bled out and died. Newspaper reports embellished the story, and they said that money was missing that he had with him. Yet it was generally accepted that he committed suicide. He was apparently deeply in debt, and he was prone to depression and other mental issues. Mental health care was not available then. I find it fascinating that an American hero died in such an ignoble way. I recommend a book called Undaunted Courage if you want to learn more about the Lewis and Clark expedition and the lives of Lewis and Clark themselves. So anyway, that's to the